Welcome back to Texas Eats. Now we're here in San Marcos to go inside of one of the top 50 barbecue joints in the Lone Star State, according to Texas Monthly. Let's go inside Hayes County Barbecue. Joining me now is Michael Hernandez. He's the co-owner out here at Hayes County Barbecue. This is one of the top spots to visit in the state of Texas for barbecue, and I'm super excited. You got a little bit of everything. Yes, sir, we do. We have pork chops here, chicken, pork ribs, spare ribs. We have brisket, and then we have our alcushi beef rib. Oh my goodness. And then we have our both kinds of sausages, uh, jalapeno cheddar and regular. You caught my attention with this one, though. Now you've switched over to the alcushi. Now this is a high-end, really marbled, fatty meat. Oh my gosh, look at the fat just running through. <laughs> One of the newest menu items that they have is their Akiyoshi beef rib. It's smaller than the dino rib, but it packs so much more flavor. It's so tender and the marbling all throughout, you know that this is a high-end cut. That's awesome. I love what's going on. I love that you've incorporated the Akiyoshi into your menu. All right, pork ribs. This is, look at that. This one's just like falling apart. This is nice and tender. I'm gonna give it a bite on top. Uh, special seasoning you can mention to us, or is it all it's, top it's secret? It's uh, salt and pepper, and okay. then we take our uh, house-made sauce, the Texas uh, sweet, and we just kind of glaze it a little bit right before. This one's all about the sauce. We get some elbow on that one. Oh my goodness! Wow. And you, you want with ribs, you want to just have a little bit of tug on there. You don't want them falling off the bone. Yeah, but as soon as you take that little bite, it just comes right off brisket. That's kind of the big boy. That's the king. So the rule with briskets is you want to be able to hold it up and then when you pull on it, it falls apart. That was a perfect brisket. <laughs> oh, wow. So for this one, I love the bark on this one especially. And that fat on this marble cut, man. This is good. This is really nice. Pork chops. That's a big deal. That's fun. Uh, we pride ourselves on it. It's probably one of the juiciest pork chops in Texas. Nice. And I'll let you decide. I'll, I'll be the judge. <laughs> mm. Oh my goodness. That really just, I mean, just melts. And to achieve that on such a heavy cut, that's a craft. My it friend. is. You're, it a, is. you're a barbecue wizard. I try to be. <laughs> chicken. What do you do with that one? What makes it special? We cook it uh, for about four hours to four and a half hours is what we uh, cook it. We cook it whole. And that leg should just bust right off just like it did. Here we go. That's the bite. The chicken that really stood out to me as kind of the sleeper, the seasoning on the outside, the skin is perfect, and that flavor goes straight down to the bone. If you love barbecue chicken, this is the one to try. Oh my goodness. The pepper on this one is so nice. I thoroughly enjoy the bite. I'm gonna take another bite. That's a, that's a two biter. That's awesome. Mm. From the chicken to the sausage in the corner right here, you say two different kinds on the menu? That is correct. It's our house made uh, sausage, which is our regular. The other two strands are the jalapeno cheddar. Oh, look at that. Big chunks of cheddar cheese all throughout as well. Jalapeno chunks in there. And you can see the little seasoning in there. Oh yeah. That's the bite. Oh wow, man, you guys are rocking. There's a reason why you are who you are and what you've done, what you've done. I mean, this is incredible. Now, you have some amazing sides. This is the one that always resonates with me. Like when I think about your place, it's the hash green chili mac and cheese. Every time. Oh, it's so good and it's creamy. And that's the problem with mac and cheese. They don't make it creamy enough. Right. Onto this one. This is a corn with jalapeno slices inside of it. You also have another potato dish right here in the corner. So what's going on with this one? That's the uh, twice baked potato casserole. Um, it has sour cream, chives. Uh, it has a little bit of bacon bits all mixed up Ooh. in one. Oh man, that's a knockout. Absolutely fantastic food. You've been around. You'll be here for decades. You guys are cranking out delicious food. Love but thank show. you so much. And you know, it's a family business. Uh, you know, locally owned, mom and pop. And this is the kind of place that you want to support. Cheers to you. You got the margarita. I got a little Arnold Palmer here action. Yes, there's alcohol in it. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button. And if you want to get notifications on new videos about restaurants from across the Lone Star State, make sure to hit that subscribe button.